I would say this, but to me, Irish people are the funniest in the world. They just are. Excuse me, are you the one off the telly? Ah, uh, yeah, I am, yeah. Can we have a picture, please? Yeah, sure. Cheers. <laughs> Except you, you are not funny. <laughs> I think the reason I see comedy in everything is because I was surrounded by it growing up. Anything else? Baby chicken? No. <laughs> my dad's funny. So is my nan. I have an uncle who claimed he was the first Irish man to eat a chow mein. And I believed him. Just like I believed him when he said he was mates with Elvis. Excuse me, guys. Okay. If you find me for us, give them to me, okay? <laughs> all right, all right. I've got one for you. A fella stops a man looking for directions. Says, what's the quickest way to get from Dublin to Belfast? And the man says, are you walking or driving? And the fella says, I'm driving. And the man says, yeah, well, that'll be the quickest way. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. I've got a better joke for you, though. You lot do that for fun. Well, come on, Sharon, take the plunge. Brilliant for the complexion. Look at us. We're gorgeous. <laughs> no, we're 105. You're 105. Between <laughs> us. And I started to notice things about the Irish that really made me laugh. Little quirks that are uniquely ours. Like, we always say thank you when we're getting off the bus. Thank you. You're welcome. And we say hello to people who pass on the street, even if we don't know them. Hi. How are you? My favourites, how we always leave a light on when we're leaving the house. Traditionally, it was a way of showing people the way home, but really, it's a way of letting them know that they're always welcome. In Ireland, one of the greatest compliments you can give someone is to describe them as a character. We thought you were lost. How are you? How's it going? Glad you can call off the search party. She's here. Because as every writer knows, it's the characters you remember long after you've forgotten the story. Fill your heart with Ireland. Discover more at Ireland.com.